frost up. Hopefully the rain stays away, at least for the next three hours anyway. Then it can do what it likes from there as what's on the ground. Just trying to pick up that footy. Never did really well as work through hands Lovell. There's 78. There is 80. Cox, but he just couldn't get near it as the ball spills free. Huss waits. The co-captains is held up. He's thrown back in from the right forward pocket. Cox against Watts. Cox just manoeuvred his man out of the way. Couldn't quite get much on the hit out though as Geelong looked to work it clear. Sending it high and away was George Stevens. High ball towards the 50. Well, that's a nice leap by Jeb Hughes. Got some nice elevation. Works into the player we've been spending time talking about in Stevens. 23rd player. Looks up. Needs to get on with it. Hardy provides the short lead. Decides to go a lot longer than that. Five from all directions. Jenner at High the ball towards the middle of Vic Park and up and over halfway. Stevens is there again. Gets the handball short. Sold his teammate short. Can Collingwood work it forward? Here's Cooper White. Well, as Huss White. Handball intercepted by Mullen. They should be able to get away here. Nevitz. Who had the disposal earlier on up to affect that as well. Chipping ball in board was an interesting one, but Stevens good enough to perhaps make it look better than it was as he looks to switch the play. So many people into this ground back in the day. 30,000 or so fitting in for clashes between these two sides. Glahesi works it out. Herbert, wide ball. And hacked it out of midair. Didn't go too far. And forward can come the Cats. Stevens reeled it in well. Gives a handball off for of Braden Ham. Both sides win. It'll be Gold Coast pretty much staying on top. It's cleared away from the congestion towards Neville Jetta. That is some take. Steen again into the rock, and again he won it down. Hardy there for another disposal. Gave the handball short. Stevens involved. Hardy works it. Go short. Stevens. And looks up. Doesn't see a hell of a lot that he likes. But the kick is a good one. Gee, good delivery. Good disposal. In. Herbert. Go back to Stevens here. That's exactly where that kick goes. So he can continue to work across the ground. Kick here in the Kroger direction, finds him. Goal. Oh, Watts decided to punch the ball back into the field of play. Mullen, Stevens. I thought, no, Never. this cannot be happening. Thrown in from the right forward pocket. Overhead of Cox, Stevens got the handball short. It was a good handball. 35-6. to six. Mainly from this guy. He gets another one down, does Mason Cox, but he's turned the footy over. The handball well. short, over the top, Mullen. Dempsey crunched. There on the scene, Stevens sends it high. Collingwood got players back, and that'll be. Four plays 4 4 28. The Giants leading the Bullets. Back in the middle we go, Managola. Stevens over the top. By then, the opportunity had gone. They cleared away off half back through air. Sent back inside 54 along by Stevens through the hands of Ben. the clearance from the stoppage. Looks like Kruger was caught high. It might not matter. Stevens takes the ball, quick kick. We'll go towards the boundary line. Looks like it'll stay in play. It is getting scrappy at the moment, given the wet weather. That's expected. Stevens over the top. So Hezzy, was he caught? And a goaler has an option short. Uses him. Stevens sends it right footed inside. Attacking 50. Again through. And for those who are unaware, that's probably not the place I'd go to get educated about selling candies. As Johnson will well know. The ball goes across to Herbert. Kruger stealing in. Well, in fairness. As it's chip short, Nevitt will help it on one more to Stevens. Long ball inside kick. 50. Good decision. That's a great ball. Michael. Oh, that time he sold some candy nicely. The kick not great though. Go from one side of the ground to the other. Stevens first onto it. The clearing ball. It's only going to be temporary. This ball. Another like. one potentially to come on. Wouldn't have thought so this late in the game. But being Mason Cox. Stevens about. looking for the clearing kick. Big win for the Pies here at their spiritual home. 74-point margin for the black and white who have romped to a victory over Geelong.